Hey friends, it's Sarah from Snacks and Crafts. Today's another installment of the maternity leave meal prep. So today's discussion is Tex-Mex. We've got crunchy tacos, soft tacos, soft corn tacos, any kind of vehicle that you want for your delicious meats and peppers and seasonings. This is my favorite cuisine. <laughs> Uh, I love Tex-Mex and traditional Mexican food. I do not personally cook traditional Mexican food, I will admit, but I do American style Mexican food. Basically, Taco Bell at home. Um, what I plan to do, the reason I bought these things ahead of time is because every week I make a, ta a taco seasoned meats. It's either gonna be chicken or ground beef. I actually have some shredded chicken in the fridge. I'm gonna prep that too. Well, not shredded chicken, it's cooked chicken breast. We're going to shred it. Um, these are the seasonings I use for those meals. When I make taco meat, I use this taco seasoning and diced green chilies, and it is delicious. Um, if I'm doing fajitas, I will just use this fajita seasoning from the Fiesta brand. I love the Fiesta brand. They're so good, and the fact that you can get like giant bulk seasonings from them. It's great. I got this off of Amazon. I couldn't find this big of a taco seasoning at my local stores, but these are about the size of the seasoning containers at my regular grocery store. We're going to shred these and package them in freezer containers so that we are ready for either fajitas or chicken tacos. And then I have my tortillas just in the pantry, ready to go whenever we so choose that meal. So that's what we're gonna do today. With all this chicken, I was gonna put it in a Ziploc bag, well, season it, put it in the Ziploc bag, um, and just have it ready. You don't even have to season it. You can leave it unseasoned and put it in the Ziploc bag. And that way it's just ready for any recipe flavor. You can use the fajita or the taco seasoning after it's defrosted, just reheat it in the pan. Um, what would be great is to kind of, instead of putting it in smaller bags in here, is once it's all in the bag, kind of press down and divide it so you can break it up into chunks and then pop it out of the bag. Let me know if you have a weekly taco night or <laughs> taco week in your household um, and what's your favorite way to eat Tex-Mex or Americanized Mexican food. Let me know in the comments. Hope this helps and that you've enjoyed these videos. Thanks so much for watching.